coast, tree and street have become three parts of me. Coast, the untamed and the elder. Tree with its stillness was a latecomer. Not really expected, but totally loved. And of course, the younger, showy and attention-seeking street. My first photographs were either side of the high tide line. I had no choice. I lived above it and played in that zone from a young age. It was my backyard. In March 1964, I bought a Kimura 400mm telephoto lens. It was my first few pay packets. A few months later, I went into Surfing World magazine in Sydney's Haymarket with five black and white photos and 250 words. And this was the beginning of my work as a writer and a photographer. My tree photography has taken me to calm, rocky outcrops. Stalking in the morning or evening light washing the humanised Angophras and their sandstone codependent partners. I love the calming solitude of sitting in the bush. The stillness as a tree emerges or morphs within the green, black and brown mosaic. The dance to find the right angle and slowly being transported to another time and place. Street photography has always been there with its harder, more elusive character, not dissimilar to the ocean. Always moving. It requires vast doses of sensitivity, patience, drive and edginess. My initial forays were fleeting, almost accidental. Photographically, the wet sand side was inhabited in the 1960s before my eyes opened to the drier side of the tidal line in the 1970s. 